Newswatch 12's Big Old Fish is brought to you by Kurtz Island Sports Shop in Manaqua. You're going to need a bigger boat. I don't know if you've thought about this or not, but let me ask you, where do you think fish go for a facelift? Why, the plastic sturgeon, of course. <sighs> Even for me, that was pretty bad. Anyway, we start off this week with Shane. Now, it says here that he caught this muskie over the winter on an area lake using a jig pole with a meps, and that he was super surprised when he caught it. Also goes on to say that this fish measured in at 37 inches and was released. Well, 37 inch musky? Yeah, that's a big old fish. Way to go, Shane. Keep on reeling them in. Next up on this week's big old fish, we have David Arneson. Now, it says here that he caught this gorgeous 28 and a half inch walleye on the Wisconsin River near Nakusa during the spring walleye run this year. It also says that he went on to release it. Well, how cool is that? 28 and a half inch walleye released to fight another day? Wow, that is a big old fish, David. Way to go. Keep on reeling them in. And finally, on this week's big old fish, we have Julia Mortar. Now, she caught this gorgeous 24 inch walleye in Price County. Also says that she caught this on her ultralight while fishing for crappie. So that had to be kind of a surprise to reel that beast in. The fish was also released to fight another day. And that's always awesome. But anyway, Julia, 24 inches, walleye, I think you know what I'm gonna say. That is one big old fish. Way to go. Keep on reeling them in. All right, fishermen and women, make sure to keep those trophy pictures coming. All the information you need to be in a future episode of Big Old Fish and win a Norling Taxidermy Fish Mill is on our website, wjfw.com. And remember, anglers, fish on.